What's up guys, General Fly here today with an Off Topic Thursday. In this video I'm going to be talking about in iOS 11 screen recording and how to transport it into a movie editor like iMovie with having sound. Now this is a bit of a problem that people having iOS 11 beta will experience and luckily enough I have actually found a um, solution to this. Now it has been bothering me because I actually downloaded iOS 11 beta because um, my other screen recorders kept on getting revoked by Apple and I know this one's not going to get revoked by Apple so actually uh, I I got it so I have it. So the problem is that I'm having with this is that if you export it to an editor it comes with no sound. Now yep I did find a solution to this so hopefully we can get straight into the video. So here I have an example video from, uh, just from all over. There's a um, So I have an example video. I'm not going to play it right now because you won't be able to hear my voice because you can't actually play a video that uh, has been uh, pre-recorded and, and then have it in the screen recording, which is also pretty unfortunate. So yeah, I'm not going to do that. But I will um, show you the steps of actually being able to do this. So first thing, first things first, I'm going to go to dub dub is an app. You're gonna go import. Uh, oh yeah, you're only allowed to do. So I'm going to delete this one here. Okay, you know I'm not gonna delete. The one is here right now. The the new recording too, is basically what I've done. So what you have to do, because I can't do more, is you're going to import. It will show you import, and then uh, you will import selection of your video you want. So I did the the, the screen recording I showed you before. And this is what it will come up with after you've done that. So it'll show you to. So it says add new sound. You don't want to touch any of that. All you want to touch is where it says send sound to another app. Now you could save this as a movie to your camera roll, but I'm not doing that. I'm just sending it to the sound to another app. So it's going to say that. And you would send it. You can find your editor. If it's not there, then you might as well save it as a movie. Uh, but then if, you, if your editor is there, you so I'm using iMovie, so I'm gonna copy it to iMovie. Okay, as you probably might have already noticed, um, it actually comes up with no sound, which, um, no, for only for the part where I go over the, um, the videos. And this is something that I'm pretty sure also works with the other screen recorders. You can't actually record videos. I did know this, um, but I didn't know that, like, if you, like, say, see, it doesn't work on iMovie. Instantly, when I went on iMovie, it just uh, instantly said uh, not working. Like it did the sound did not come on, but what I don't understand is when I went back to the home page, why it didn't um continue the sound, so that's something that also interests me, so yeah, but I hope you followed along there and understood what was going on, so I will just explain you now how to do it step by step. I'll also leave a little image at the end showing you step by step what to do, so the first step to do is you will uh, have your recording obviously. Now what you want to do with that recording, you want to go to iMovie and put it in there, or you can do it later on actually. You know what, you can do it later on. What you will do first is you will just go to um, dub dub, you will go to that part where it says import, import your video, um, and then after that you will have it import, and then all you do after that is go and say export it to, uh, I think it was export it to a different application. Do that. Export it to a different application, do it to your uh, editor, or you can actually bring it to photos if it did show up with your editor, but 
I'm use iMovie, so export it to iMovie. Then overlay it with your video. It should be synced, um, because it will actually start at the beginning at both lines. And that's about it. Then you all you will do after that is done, and then save it to your camera roll and do whatever the rest you want to do with that video. So yeah, sorry about all that happened there. Um, other than that, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment, share, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.